Now, these are the default icons that I've got. These are the One UI icons on Samsung Galaxy phone. Now, let me just press and hold on the home screen, tap on themes and uh, go to the menu and tap on my stuff where I will find my own icons which I have downloaded from Galaxy Store. But the problem here is, when I apply these icons, they don't get applied to all the icons that we have on the system. Let me show you that. I've got some beautiful looking icon packs here downloaded from the uh, Galaxy Store and these are free icon packs. And when I select this particular icon pack and apply it, as you can see, the changes have been applied on the system icons. You will see these beautiful looking icons here. However, the third party icons do not get this effect. As you can see, if I go to the add tray, they don't look uniform. Most of the third party icons do not get this icon effect. And what's worse is some icons get different shape altogether. As you can see here, we've got some squircles as well as some rectangle shaped icons here which is actually not good at all. As you can see this Wipro icon here, they are all in different shapes without even getting the new icon effect. So that is really bad. Now for this, we have got a solution. Of course, we can install the third party icon packs to get this uniformity across all the icons. But in this video, I'm gonna show you one third party application, which is very unique. And those icons can be applied through GoodLock module to get the uniformity on all the icons. And that third party application is just fantastic. Before we go ahead, if you're interested in this home screen wallpaper, the link is in the description. Every video I post will have a brand new wallpaper. You can download them. And if you're someone who want to know your phones better, then you need to subscribe to the channel because I share a lot of tips and tricks, update related videos, and a lot of tech related videos. So go ahead, subscribe, and give this video a like if you find this video informative. Now the app I'm showing you is called icon pack studio you can download this from play store i will leave a link for that in the description when you open the application you will instantly see some beautiful looking uh, icon packs as you can see we have got this black and white effect here we have got some beautiful looking uh, glassy effect here then we have got some different shapes here as you can see these are some beautiful looking icons some of them are pro and some of them are available for free and there's a different way to install these icon packs i'm going to show you exactly that in a bit let me just take you through all these icon packs here you see most of them are free here some of them are pro this is all posted by the community here and if you go to the library you will get uh, what you have already installed or downloaded you will get to see those icon packs right here you see i've got dark one ui icon pack this is just beautiful i have got another dark icon pack here which i have downloaded as you can see i can just tap on apply to apply this icon pack but that is not as simple as it seems now what you need to do is after you install the uh, application you need to first download an icon pack from here let's go to the community here let's try this icon pack this is a free icon pack we have let me tap on this i will just tap on download here now the icon pack has been downloaded let me tap on this now let me tap on apply now it says exported icon packs are for personal use only remember you cannot sell or distribute icon packs which are based on material uh, produced by other people so these are produced by the people in the community you cannot really sell them or distribute them is what it says now let me just tap on don't show it again i'll tap on ok now it says we are now converting your icon pack to a format compatible with your launcher so you will have to use this icon pack with a launcher but for samsung galaxy phones we don't really need a third party launcher we can use it right on one ui home launcher using the good luck application it says your icon pack is ready your icon packs have been placed in your device's download folder. Use your file manager to navigate to the folder and install the file exported icon pack APK. So this icon pack has been downloaded in the form of APK and we can go ahead and install it, but make sure you have turned off the auto blocker feature. To turn off the auto blocker feature, all you need to do is just go to the settings, tap on security and privacy. This is where you will find auto blocker. Just disable it before installing this APK. Now, since I downloaded that icon pack, what I'll do is I will go to the uh, files application here. You can see one minute ago, I have downloaded this uh, icon pack. It's .apk file. Let me tap on this. It says, do you want to update this application? I'll tap on update. Exported icon pack is getting installed right here. Now, once it is installed, you can tap on done or you can tap on open. Now, this is the app. At the bottom, we have how to apply. You will be able to understand how exactly you can apply. I'm going to show you that exactly now. So now all you need to do is just go to good Lock application, tap on theme park. Now, this is where you will find options to customize the theme, uh, keyboard, quick panel, and we have got icon here. Now let's go ahead and create a new icon here. 
This is where we can customize these icons. We can change the shape of the icons, uh, whichever icons you have already installed. You can change the icon color and tray color. Now what we're gonna do is we can tap on this option here, icon pack. Let me tap on this. This is where you will find Samsung icon pack, which you have downloaded from Galaxy Store. And uh, you will also find the third party icon packs. You can tap on download to uh, install more or you can tap on exported icon pack here. That is what we have exported just now. I'll tap on this. It is loading the image and here it is. We have got this icon pack right here. Now we can't really customize this further. If I select the shapes, it will not change the shape there. So we will leave it as it is. I'll tap on download. I'll just enter a name for this. Tap on OK. Here it is. This is the one which we just installed using Theme Park Engine. I'll tap on this and tap on apply. It says the default theme must be applied. Do you want to apply the default theme? I'll tap on OK. So the OneUI's default theme is being applied here. Now we will have to go back here and apply this icon. Let me tap on this and tap on apply. This is just looking amazing, isn't it? All the icons are uniform now, not just with the new effect. It is also in the same size and shape and they all look just beautiful. Now this is how this third party application helps us get this uniformity in applying these icon effects. And it also offers plenty of free options, plenty of free icon packs, which is just amazing. Now here there are a couple of icons which are not getting this effect. That is because these are the shortcuts that I've created. Uh, these are not the icons actually. So uh, for shortcuts, you will not get the, uh, the icon effect here. So keep that in mind. Now let me open icon pack studio again. There are plenty of cool icon packs here. I have already downloaded one more icon pack, which I want to show you. This is a dark one UI icon pack. Let me tap on this. This is how it's going to look. I'll tap on apply, tap on OK. Your icon pack is ready. I'll tap on OK again. It has been downloaded. I'll tap on this and update the uh, icon pack. It is exporting it and installing it. I'll open it. Now let's go to good luck again. Theme park, create new icon pack. Tap on icon pack and scroll down, exported icon pack, and it has just loaded that dark icon. So we'll not have all those packs separately here. It will just update the existing icon pack itself. Now I'll tap on download, rename it, dark, tap on done. It's right here. I will select this, apply. Now let's see how it's going to look. Here we go. This is the dark icon pack that we have got, and it actually looks pretty cool. You can see I'll open the folders here. This is the Google folder. Samsung folder, they all are looking just amazing. And that is not it. You can further customize these icon packs on the application itself. If you go to the library and select the application pack that you have already installed, you can just go there and tap on edit option here. As you can see, we've got some options here to customize these icons further. We've got design. We can tap on move option to just tap on this and move this icon here. As you can see, the icon itself is moving within the background. You can adjust the way you want it. Uh, you can also change the fill color here. We will be able to change the color of the icon and we can change the opacity as well here. As you can see, it is changing right here. Let me just go back. We can tap on stroke to change the uh, opacity here again and increase the thickness of the stroke or decrease it depending on your requirement. And then we have got shadow, inner shadow, long shadow. All these customization options are available. So this app allows us to further customize the icon pack which you have already downloaded. So it's actually insane how deep you can customize these icon packs within this third party application itself. So go ahead, try this out. You need the icon pack studio application itself and you need good log to install these apps or you can also install third party launchers and install these icon packs. Let me know what you think, drop a comment and don't forget to give this video a like and do not forget to subscribe to the channel. That's about it. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.